hi welcome to my channel guys welcome 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 so i wanted to talk to you today for those of you who are doing self-discovery awakening and ascension research you know trying to heal yourself your past your present your future um if you're in my spirit of um of ascension because i won't say influence because i'm not a guru i'm not interested in that type of stuff this is just information that i feel like really helped me so i just really want to pass it along so i wanted to talk about you know if you're a feminine embodying your inner divine masculine and becoming and embodying and integrating and um and just becoming aware and setting that part of you free and healing that aspect of yourself because honestly that's a if you're on my channel your inner divine masculine is possibly a lost aspect that you didn't know you even had had to connect to or probably just focused on your divine inner feminine god so or if you're a, a masculine you probably only focus on your masculine energy but not really aware that you have a divine feminine eternal god spirit within you as well so these are just uh two things that i wanted to talk to you about that it's just very important that we embrace our div inner divine inner divinity okay inner divinity inner divine union between your divine masculine eternal self and your divine feminine eternal self so it's just very important to know that you do have both aspects of yourself and this this is not taught to us so actually we're a little bit incomplete we're a little bit incomplete we're a lot fragmented until we we're a lot fragmented until we actually embody both our masculine and our feminine energies so you do need your masculine side and you do need your feminine side and it's just very important to know that it is not separated it is not separated it can be it, you can block it off it can be altered of course everything in this world has already been corrupted damaged challenged changed infected infiltrated by off off planet on planet social conditioning pre-birth plans this is not your pre-manifest plan though your your pre-manifest plan is to be in perfect harmony and symmetry and symmetry with your divine inner masculine and inner feminine so those are two things that you do have to be aware of that you do have an inner you have inner work to do okay you have inner work to do okay because what you perceive about men is going to be in you in that masculine side of you even though you don't acknowledge it or you're not aware of it so this is very important that you activate that you awaken that you release that you free you know all of the practices that you do for yourself you should absolutely do it for your masculine as well because the masculine is you you do have a masculine and a feminine side and so i believe that you know the planet is going through um this is this is actually opposites merging and pairing so that it can it can be brought into perfect divine union you know your perfect higher self your perfect um your perfect divine self your perfect god self your higher self can be absolutely integrated and in harmony and in alignment you really can't be in alignment with your divine purpose divine plan pre-manifest plan until you actually have incorporated all parts of you integrated all parts of you so definitely please i wanted to share this message because it's so beautiful to know that you you know all of the work that you're doing on your gender you now have to do on your other your other side so that you can be in perfect alignment and that you can ascend because you really and truly cannot ascend without your counterpart anyway okay but you are that counterpart it can actually be somebody or it can actually just be inner your inner sanctuary your inner holy chambers your inner self your in your higher heart your higher monad your higher avatar so these are just the um these are just the elements that i wanted you to be aware of that you know um integrating your divine masculine and feminine within first is the proper way to spiritual marriage sacred marriage inside to connect to your guardians to connect to your guides to connect to your past to unlock your divine future so this is um this is what i have for you guys today i hope that you um i hope that you enjoy the message please do like share and subscribe and do let me know um if you have any further comments too if you have anything further i will actually get more into detail but i just wanted to release this video because um when I, when I realized and when I was introduced to my masculine side, I was like, oh my God, I've been doing all of the work on my feminine side, but I haven't been doing any work on my masculine side. So I'm just very happy and I'm just very, um, it just, it's very inspiring. And for all purposes of information only, this is all information only. So I hope that you know, you take the information and you run with it and you share it and you like it and you subscribe. Thank you guys for watching.